What's up guys, today I'm going to be showing you some starter Pokemon content. A while ago I started thinking about my own Pokemon starters and my region, so I thought I'd share it with you in this video. I know a lot of people have already done this. Some of their designs can be funny or just overall really good, but don't really fit the Pokemon style. I'm hoping to make something that actually feels like it could be made in Pokemon. You guys all know that it's really fun to insert yourself in such a popular franchise. I've done it a lot before too, even on this channel, but those videos are deleted now. Anyway, it's pretty hard to create a Pokemon design that actually feels like it's made by the Pokemon company. They feel too thought out and complicated for the average person to make. But I'm going to show you how I made it and hopefully guide you through the process too. So, these are the concepts I had for a Pokemon for an, of new generation. And don't worry, it won't take that long because these concepts are raw and haven't really been developed. The Grass Starter is an American mink pretending to be a Chimera. The Fire Starter is a donkey who thinks he's a god. The Water Starter is an aquatic hermit crab who can box. So now it's time to make three new evolutionary lines to represent these ideas. I started off with this sketch of what I wanted, but I thought it was too like the real animal, like too like, it isn't cartoony enough. So I moved to digital for these next designs. I started off by tracing the proportions of an already existing Pokemon but it just wasn't working out so I had to thin the design out a bit and eventually started adding some more details. I wanted it to be chubby but not too chubby and this design just wasn't working for me. It wasn't conveying the types of themes that I wanted. You know, you couldn't really tell that it was trying to pretend to be something. Plus, it didn't really look like an American mink. So then I moved on to my next design. I started off by tracing the closest thing we already have to an American mink and trying to add a tail that was actually a leaf but kind of looked like a snake so that it could give that chimera aspect. I also needed to add a mane like a lion to resemble that lion aspect. I also know that minks don't actually have very big ears um, but I still wanted it to look cute by giving it ears so I thought the ears could maybe be a fake as aspect of this design. I wasn't really happy with this design for the first couple of stages and left it for a bit but I eventually came back to it and after drawing on the colours of some other Pokemon like Bulbasaur the design started to really come together and I really liked it. This is Trimink, the American Mink Pokemon. It has the ability of which most grass starters have. It also has a pretty good autumn shiny um, and its silhouette is quite recognisable, I think. Um, Trimink is a Pokemon given to young trainers and is very cute and lovable, but he's actually quite vicious and deceitful. It has pretty good stats and is an all round pretty good first stage starter Pokemon. Just a quick reminder before you start the video, if you've been watching it this far in, you probably will like my channel. So can you subscribe? I'm hoping to get to about 100 subscribers, it's my milestone till the end of 2024, so hopefully I can get there. Now this next design for the fire starter was a lot more easy and came a lot more naturally to me. I don't know why, but with the already existing, um, like base plates for fire horses even though this one's a donkey were very simple and i really liked the patterns i did on the face this one came really quickly all i did was tilt its head up so it looked like it was looking down on people like it was a god and thought it was better than everybody else and it was done this is Hefler, the fire starter with the ability blaze this pokemon is incredibly hard to train for young trainers due to its rebellious nature it's shiny is pretty cool with the blue flames, you can never go wrong. Um, and it's all around a pretty good Pokemon. This design was quite hard to get right because there's not many starters that don't really have legs. Um, I originally tried to make its head pop out of its shell, like its shell was a casing, but that wasn't working. So eventually I made it go inside the shell and I did a coastal biome on top, as well as those claws that it has can inflate. Now to and move on to the digital polished piece. After working out all the hard bits on paper, this one was really easy. Just tracing it over and adding the right colours digitally and it was done in like five seconds, even though obviously this this um, time lapse is sped up. This is 
Crabulon, the hermit crab Pokemon, and the water type starter. It's shiny, is white, and lighter colours all around. It has the ability to torrent. Crabulon is a small, has a small crustal biome growing on its back and can inflate its claws into sturdy bubbles that it uses to save and protect others. Um, I really like this Pokemon, to be honest. I think it's a pretty good design. So there you are, my three starters. I am planning on making this a whole region, and just a tip, the region is based off Greece. Um, so it's going to be a whole region. Stay tuned for, no, for more videos. The next one is going to be about the evolutions to these Pokemon.